guys, welcome back to Red Dog Gaming, where today we are continuing our Sparta campaign in RTR Imperium Serectum. And I've just realised I haven't done this, but you can see the vast swathe of our empire right now. We are pretty large, pretty big, and we're having a decent time. We're having a decent time. Uh, but we are at war with the Romans now, so that's slightly scary. And when I say slightly, I mean very scary <laughs> right now. Um, however... A little bit of admin, guys, first. So, my save for this episode actually was corrupted. But luckily, because of the autosave, it took me to the turn before this, where we were still sieging down Arkadava. Uh, so, I've done redone everything exactly the same. I've gone through the laborious process of watching my video back from the Arkadava siege and trying to do exactly the same. I've done all the buildings the same. I've moved the armies the same. Um, but if there's any minor differences, that will be the reason why. Now, um, we did actually lose a few more troops on the second Siege of Arkadava, which I did. Uh, including a lot of archers and a lot of Skiritai, really, was the main uh, main losses there. Uh, however, uh, you know, we still won the Siege and we still have Arkadava. I still got the same number of troops in each place. Um, so... That's uh, that's over and done with. Now, I do believe we are at the end of a turn right now. But I just want to kind of go over the armies, guys, for uh, for a second. Just to see where we're up to. Because if we look at our money, we've gone down quite considerably in money. Seeing as we've started pumping out these troops like no tomorrow. Which is fine. Um, because it's an investment for the future. But we do have to be slightly careful still and not overreach ourselves too much. Otherwise, we will go into the negative of money. So we're going to have to focus on monetary buildings for a while. Um, yeah, I would like some Cryptia to take over Restia. Uh, how are we looking over here? So that is an experienced one. That's fine. Shrine to Hero. Okay, well, we're good. So we have... A bit of a mix match army over here. And once Sarmat Gizegatuza and Argadava are happy, then we shall move them out. But they're not going to be happy for some time just because Greek isn't getting uh, converted over here because of some of our neighboring provinces. However, um, Oiskos is becoming Greek. If we can make Tylus Greek, that will help quite considerably as well. And Tylus is becoming Greek and is happy at the same time, which is awesome. Uh, Philippopolis is fully Greek now. It's more these other surrounding territories like Thomas um, and Orestia and Samogizgertuza, Darkadaba. So that's fine. We have these two armies. This one's coming back for Pella. That was the one that took Arkadaba. And then we have Echepolus, a new general, going forth to fight the Romans. Uh, we have Iada. Salona, we have this army sieging down Suggestica, which is obviously a little bit risky, but it's definitely worth doing for now. We have this army up here in the north, trying to finally destroy the Getai. Kind of don't really like that, though, because uh, it's going to lead us open to fighting the Germanians on like quite a large front, and I don't think we can afford to fight a three-front front war right now. Um... So I would like to destroy the damn Adrissians quite quickly in this area. So I might even consider sending uh, Cleonymus. Cleonymus the cold-hearted. What a name. He is a boy though. He is. He might be cold-hearted, but he is a boy. He is an absolute beastly man. So we will send him... Potentially we'll send him east to deal with the Adrissians quickly. We have two armies on the way for the Romans, which is fine for now. Uh, we've got a lot of armies. We've got about six full stacks, I'd say. Six, probably. Because uh, once this one's retrained, we've got some uh, more troops ready to go. So, cool. Right then, guys. I think we're at the end of a turn after that screed. So, I will uh, end the turn here, and we shall see what happens. Potentially, the Romans might attack us. We've also got the Adrissians on the horizon that might... Want to have a bit of a go at us. That's fine though. That's fine. Um, yeah, I just don't like the fact that we're at war with the Suebi. Like, it's just pointless. I really don't want that land either. Now, that land up there is not going to be great for us. It's so far away from our homeland. I really would like to take Italy rather than the Suebi. But what we can do is just man the defenses. Okay, well... 
Now, Numerius Fabius Pictor. Oh, Jesus Christ. It's, I don't think we win this, guys, you know. As I say, these Roman troops are just so good. That it's, it's pretty much impossible. They have no cavalry, though. That's a huge boon to us. Let's fight. So we know... The big army's coming in from directly behind us. We can try and trap them against that wall then. They're on a road as well. There'll be a road facing towards where they are. So let's just take that as a frame of reference. And guys, I will see you on the battle map. Here we are, guys. Today, we look for a victory worthy of Hercules. Yes, we do. This is a mighty task, but we are men enough to do it. Right then. Let's... Uh, you can see the settlement over there. So, they're going to be coming in here. Let's freaking squish them. Let's squish them, boys. Ah, yes. Perfect. God, you've got to use dirty tactics against the Romans, guys. I promise you. Otherwise, you will lose. <laughs> so, let's do it. There they are. Aha. Okay. Boys, if you could get there, maybe. Wait, well, let's just just focus this side then. Let's get there. Go, 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 boys, go. Yes. Let's go. We're in big fat blocks. Might not be the best thing to do, but it's, you know, something. You guys get there. Protect that flank. Same with you boys. We'll bring you over here. Yes, the phalanxes are on the way. Fight, boys, fight. What's this, then? More Hastati. I don't want to deal with that. Get the general. Is it Python? No, you are mom. Get him over there. You fight those Hastati. So we've stopped them from throwing their javis for a little while. Why, yeah, why are you not in phalanx? Guys, it's very important that you get into phalanx. Right, cavalry. Once they're engaged, these ones on the right-hand side, we will have to uh, charge them, I think. It's the only chance of winning this. <sighs> this is going to be really tough to win. Right, you charge that Hastati in the middle there. It's going to all depend on whether we kill that general. Where is he? He's there. He's there. Hoping he dies. Okay, he has decided to do that, which is a bit stupid. Oh, right, let's charge them in the back quite quickly. Then we'll charge that Hastati there in the back. Come on, Cab, let's go. Yes, good charge, good charge. Good, really good charge. Doing that much damage to the Romans at this point is decent. We will charge that Hastati as well. How is that Tribunus surviving? That's him, right? Where is the general, though? Where is he? Is that him there? That looks like him. What's this? There's one Hastati there. That's fine. Come on, boys. Straight through these. Into that Hastati at the back. Guys, you, not, you cannot fight with your alt attack. You must be in phalanx. Your alt attack is not good enough to fight these guys. I promise you. Yes, now he's dead. That's good. So we might not take the settlement here. But we might be able to break a few of these guys. And I kind of need to get around this far side. So we'll do it this way. Uh, let's come over here. Let's go. In fact... Send two of you guys back this way. You can just come here just for uh, 
Bit of extra organisation. Getting that Hastati. Okay, we broke them guys. Get into that Hastati as well. Come on, the Phalanxes. This is it. This is it. This is what I like to see, boys. This is what I like to see. Come on, boys. Let's go. Let's go. This is what you get when you don't bring cavalry. We've got trash cavalry. And even a, it's still helpful. We still might lose, guys, though. That's the other thing. Like Those Hastati don't seem like they want to route. Oh, my God. Full-scale route over this side, guys. Full scale route. Now into the back of that has started. You guys fight them as well. Back again. Cycle these bloody charges, boys. Yes, get them. Get them. Get them all. Kill them all. Glorious. Glorious. Yes. Oh, this is just glorious, boys. This is just glorious. Fantastic. This is what we like to see, boys. Routing Romans everywhere. Get in the back of them. Yes, we're just running rampant. Oh, fantastic. We're not going to probably be able to take the city with this as well. Slightly unfortunate. Okay, we have taken a, quite a considerable amount of damage with these guys. You guys just get there. Anyone? Ah, oh, there we go. Go and kill that guy. Alright, you boys. Let's go. You boys, let's get out. Who's over here? There's still Princopes on that side. You boys. Uh, enemies? Where are the enemies? There, probably. It's best. Can't really see. <laughs> Don't throw your javies, for God's sake. They're still steady. Out, boys, out. Out, damn spot. How are these guys... So everyone else is routed, but these guys are just steady. They're just fine. <laughs> They're a bit shaken now, though. It's good. Oh, this guy's getting shredded. The gods have filled the enemy general with fear. Now he flees the field like a coward. Kill those Velites. Yeah, that's another one dead. Fine. Charge these goddamn Hastati. Right, you charge from this side as well. I'm sure we'll manage to break them this time. Both sided charge. Sandwich. That's got to break them. Yes, now on to these boys. Let's go. Break them. Break them. Come on. Break the fools. This poor guy is getting shredded. We need to save him. All right, save, save, save. Go and save. Okay. You go fight them. It says 10%. It says we've killed like most of them. Okay, they're broken. Yes. Get them. Get them! That's ours. Oh, continue. Just kill as many as we can. Just to make sure we take the city. That is a full stack of Roman troops we will have killed, boys. If this is a... This has happened. Okay, get them. We need to get them. Go, go, go. 46. He will still be alive. And that will mean that he will uh, take the... Like, retreat into the city. Oh, no, it's under siege, so he shouldn't do that. But let's just make sure that he can't do that. <laughs> oh, these poor phalangites down to four. Well, another army that needs retraining, boys. Um, but we will wait till that other army gets up here for that. Anyway, right, let's speed it up. I just want to make sure that we catch these guys up. Give them a bit of hiding. Oh, nice. Get there. You guys get there. Let's go. Let's go, boys. Let's go. What a battle. We shredded them. Shredded those goddamn Romans. Fantastic. Oh, and we killed like 50% more than them as well. Oh, fantastic.
fantastic. Spartan Cavalry doing the most, of course. I mean, the Phalangites, they don't do that well, <laughs> generally. But they are the just standard type. Like, when we get the more upgraded ones. And obviously, the more experience they have, the better they're going to become every time. Ah, oh, fantastic. Fantastic. That was very enjoyable. Absolutely smashed them. Well, guys, I'll see you on the campaign map. Here we are, guys. And we did take it. And I think we'll enslave, get a bit of population growth going in some of our other settlements to try and, you know, help us with our money situation, I guess you could say. Hmm. We're getting blockaded at Rhodes. That's not great. You're 38, so no, I'm not going to accept that. A new merchant. He has several enemies. <laughs> Well, where are you? Just go and do what you want, my friend. Go away. Right. Aravachi and Arvernia at war. That's fine. Clear Nymos, the cold-hearted. What a boy. I hope they raise statues to you, Clear Nymos. You have been an absolute warrior. A true Spartan warrior, my friend. Right, let's do our building, guys, first. Oh, I don't want to be on the agent hub. Megalopolis. We can go for law. Well, it's not really too much to do here. Um, let's get the first... Oh, is that trade income, though? It's so good. Look at that trade. 2,600. There's nothing else we can do, really, to bump up that population growth. How does this do? Oh, we'll, we'll build that. That gives us some nice bonuses to money, anyway. Uh, Argos. We are getting growth in Argos, so Megalopolis shouldn't be too much of a worry. Uh, let's go for... As I, say, as I say, we'll go for a few more monetary buildings to try and get us back to a decent monetary uh, situation. Uh, Bylazora. Yeah, Bylazora is building to try into Ares. Oh, Orkremenos. I didn't build there, did I? Orkamenos has upgraded as well, which is excellent. We can get the Pantheon for population growth. <laughs> it's still got population growth, even though it's a huge city as well, which is decent. Let's go for the... Uh, oh, I did want money buildings, didn't I? Let's go for the Merchant's Quarter then. Uh, Amphipolis. Amphipolis has just taken that. So Amphipolis should be pretty Greek. Oh, it is. Fantastic. That's great to see. Let's go for Temple of Artemis, potentially. Let's go for that. Uh, right then. Skodra got some large mines. That's excellent. Let's go for the crop rotation next. That's money and population growth. Salona. Let's go for the large mines at Salona. Makes a lot of money. Argadava. Oh, Argadava. What do we want to do with you? We doing population? Yeah, we are converting the population over here. Let's go for the paved roads then. Allows us to move around a little bit quicker as well. Oh, Sigrin and Dum got the paved roads as well, which is brilliant. So let's go for the sewers there. A quincum. Hmm. Are we? Yeah, we are converting a quincum as well. And it is Greek now. It is Greek. Fantastic. That's excellent to see. And I think what we'll do with a Quincum is, is fortify it. If we take a Sanka, then we have a line of three cities that we can fortify against the damn Germanians. And rather than worry too much about pushing against them. Because I, I don't want this land currently, guys. I want to focus on Rome. Uh, we will just try and defend those settlements. How much do they have in a Sanka? Oh, they've got a lot of Getic Light Infantry. Getic heavy infantry. So light infantry in one army, heavy infantry in the other. I think we it's worth risking it for that, though. Right, so we were at Quincum. So Arkidava we need to build as well. We could go for conversion here. That's not going to be good, though, is it? Oh, it's about equal, actually. Well, let's go for paved roads here so we can move through there as well. No, we really, actually, we really need to focus on happiness. So get the sewers. Ah, well, this army at Suggestica. We need to focus on Suggestica for a second. Dionysus is just happiness. It's not brilliant, is it? It keeps them happy, though, so that's okay. I think the same thing we'll do at Suggestica is build a 
large wall. Hmm. We can, uh, yeah, because they're, they're very likely to come and attack us right now. They have some decent infantry as well. It's another very heavy infantry army. But it is the Romans, guys, so what do we expect? <laughs> Fortunately, the Adrissians didn't actually attack us then, did they? Hello? Who are you? It's a large... Do that. Apparently lost 200 there, but... Oh, it's just annoying fighting the rebels. So we need to come around... Wait. Oh my god. Well, why is that banner so big? That banner should not be that big. Look at the banner. The banner's like three quarters full and they've got four units. <laughs> well, that's stupid. Right then. Well, we've got this army in Pella. But, Cleonimos, my friend, I don't think you just want this army in Pella. We'll take the archers we have. There's only... Oh, there is four of them. Excellent. Let's take those archers. They're not very experienced. They must be relatively new. Take a few of you guys. Uh, you need to go in there. And we'll take some of these new guys as well. That's five spaces for cavalry now. That's good. If you two can merge, that would be excellent. Yes, we've got one there. One there. So that's five. Wait, that's three. Why is that three? I'm sure I selected those guys as well. Maybe I didn't press control. We will, however, get these guys upgraded. Well, we can. Might as well. We're going to need them. We're going to need them nicely upgraded, aren't we? Uh, and then you, my friend, you can get into Pella. Go for your retraining. We actually have some decent units left behind by that army. And this... We could put together another army relatively soon as well. That's excellent. Train the boys. Fantastic. All right, we might as well send you guys up to Bailazora. Thermon will send up the cavalry as well. Join them. And then in Athens, we had a few, didn't we? We had archers. We need archers, honestly. Can we train archers here? I mean, ideally, Amphipolis would be the best place. So we should probably build that archery range at some point. Now, Philippopolis. That's garrison troops. Hello, Getai. Where did you come from? You're quite a big army, honestly. Oh, they've gone down low now. Can we get another 15... Another 5% from religious buildings? That's... Ah, it's not enough. I think we're going to have some issues at Sarmizigetuza. Right. Is there any way we can leave uh, Protus? Greek is getting converted up there. Hmm. Sus, my friend. We have the people in Philippopolis. Some big armies around, though. Very big ones. Hmm. I mean, it's fine holding Arrestia right now. It doesn't really matter too much. Well then, I think if that's everything this turn. Do we have any... We don't have anyone on boats, right? Just, just checking. I don't want there to be anyone on the boats. Yeah, there isn't. Just in case. Because <laughs> on Carthage, my Carthage game, I left an army on the boats for quite a while. <laughs> Which is relatively funny, but also quite a problem. Right, let's end the turn there, guys. Ah, lovely. Sparta is glorious. Glorious Sparta. We are so large right now as well. We're pretty big. Like, maybe not... Well, I say it is a large landmass. But we are, yeah, we are pretty decently big. Okay, Getai's attacking us. That was kind of expected. A lot of missile cav. I hate to deal with the missile cav. Even more missile cav. Infantry, 
reasonably scary. Armor-piercing secondary weapon. That's not great for us to deal with. <sighs> They're attacking us, though. So we can... Uh, it's probably best if we hang in the right corner, I'd say. Well then, guys. I'll see you on the battlefield. Here we are, guys. And look, this is, a fine day for battle. Every day is it really? Is a fine day for battle. Oh, these trees are not going to be helpful. Really not going to be helpful. Oh, just so many trees. <gasps> ah! I hate the trees. Where will they be coming from, though? There's no roads in this area. Wherever we go is kind of cursed, honestly. <laughs> I want to go down the bottom of the hill. Luckily, the trees are dead. <laughs> we'll have a nice spread like that. And we'll get these guys behind. Nah, we'll get them in front for the time being. Who is this again? Eatrocles. We've got so many new generals, it's hard to remember which one's which. Guys there. You guys there. Well, I guess we could have come here and mashed up that hill. That's too many trees, though. Well, let's see where... The, we won't be able to see them. Okay, we see that army. Okay, the army's coming from the right over there. That's completely fine. Because I believe this army will attack us first. Well, let's uh, try set up a bit like that. Slightly better position, isn't it? You guys... Run. Let's get our missile men forward. Cavalry forward as well. That's the most important thing. Because they're going to be incredibly useful in this battle. Cavalry there. Ideally, if you could hide in the trees, that would be great. Okay, Missile Cav. Do your worst. You guys phalanx now. You guys are already in phalanx. Oh, come on guys. Catch them. It looks like you just caught them. Oh, I don't want to lose all my cav to their damn missile cav. Ah, oh, damn it. Turn quick. Yes, we got him. We got him. Caught them. Thing is, our cav is, is trash, as we know. So they might not even win this. <laughs> yeah, looks like they're not. Oh, we're getting shredded there. Let's go hide in the woods over there. Right, archers. Let's get you back. Can we hide? Where is that general? He's there. It's a Getic Royal Bodyguard. It's pretty tough. It's a pretty tough unit. Right, are you hidden now? Hide, hide, hide. Now charge them again. I'm going to have to charge them back. Charge is the only way we can win this. And it didn't even work that well. Oh, we did did a decent amount of damage. It's shaken. Uh, our, our units have run now. That's unfortunate. Are you guys hiding? Yes, you are. Good. Where is this cavalry going? That's what I want to know. Okay, so we lost both those units up there. Those cavalry. What the hell? Fight them. God damn. They got around the back. How the hell did they get... They got through this unit. I hate that. Why can they charge through a fucking phalanx, bro? They should not be able to charge through a phalanx. Whatever whatever the case is, they should not be able to damn charge through a phalanx, bro. However good cavalry it is. Fuck me, bro. Just charge straight through. Kill these dumb fools. Missiles get out. Get that. Uh, now we're getting fought from both sides. So I'll let my general deal with these noble cavalry. 
Yeah, that's better. That's better. You fight them. Yeah, you've come back. Get you down here to fight those guys. Please charge my phalanx. Yes, he is. Good. Good. So how can that happen? How can he get through the phalanx like that? Shouldn't happen. Okay, you guys are fighting decently. It's just so hard to see anything. In the back of them. Now, you guys get out. Okay, they're running. The fools. We'll come back then. That's fine. Please charge again, my friends. He is charging again. Good. Hate that the, the, the skirmish of Cav. God damn. How are these guys still alive, bro? Ah, oh, this poor unit's going to get shredded. Turn around. Fight that goddamn skirmish of Cav. More cavalry. Breaking through everywhere. What is going on? I can't see. <laughs> Fuck me, bro. Oh, you should be able to kill them. Come on. Now, we're going to have to get the cavalry over here, is it? Last resort. You get out. You just go. You go. We're getting... Oh, we need to save our general here. Let's go fight them. I can't see. General's fighting to the death now. That's really not good. Broke one of them. Broke one of them. Broke another. Come on, break them. Break these fools. Okay, we're doing okay over here, it looks like. You get there. You guys, let's move you up. We killed them yet? Yes, nice. Good. Okay, no one else on the left flank. We can move these guys up then. Get there. This cavalry. Okay, we need to go get this cavalry in there now. Okay, that second general is just a Dacian skirmisher cav. It's not going to be a worry. It's this, fur this, other this other general we need to kill. Oh my god, we're getting shredded here. Just getting shredded by superior cavalry movements. Where's our general? Stop running. Come back. Kill this fool. Kill him. Kill him for God's sake. Why are you running over there? Kill him. God damn it, bro. Okay, they've gone across the line now. That's fine. That's good. That's what we wanted. Yes, nice. That's killed their king. God damn. Foolish king. Okay, that phalangite on the right and flank has just died. So let's get into this skirmish of cav. There. Charge should be enough here. I'm hoping. To deal with these guys. Kill this guy as well. His general. Yes, broke his general. Yes, that's it. This is it, boys. This is it. Let's go. This was a much tougher battle than I anticipated. Get them. Get them. Come on, they've just had a morale shock. How are they still eager? Get those fools. Okay, that's not going to end well, is it? Okay, well, we're not going to win this. We're not going to win that. Get out, get out, get out. I don't think we win. I think we're going to lose, guys. I think we're going to lose. Get a charge in there if you can. Before we completely die. Just cavalry everywhere. <laughs> God damn. 
too much cavalry for us to deal with. Especially with our trash cavalry. That's it, guys. We're gone. We're done. Everyone else, get out. Actually, I'd prefer them to be broken rather than... I prefer them to be broken so that we can end the battle slightly earlier. That's it, that's it. Oh, this cavalry, it's this cavalry. Where are you? Okay, you're gone. Oh, that was just brutal. That was just absolutely brutal. Our cavalry... So that's what happens when our cavalry can't roam free, guys. Ah, oh, Jesus. I was not expecting that. It looks like Clear Nymos might have to go up to the da darn Getai then. Ah, oh, the Getai just refused to die. It's very sad. It's very sad to see. Well then, guys, I'll see you on the campaign map. Here we are, guys. Yep, yeah, we've run all the way back to Dark Adarba. Unsurprisingly. That other Getai army has disappeared, though. That's kind of scary. It's probably lining ambush somewhere. God damn. God damn. God damn these fools. Getai just refused to die. Get out, you Getai. Oh, we lost a lot of troops in that. Look. This is all that's left of the army. The Atrocles. Yeah. Did you get any bad traits from that? Let's have a look. No, you didn't. Interesting. It's fine. Kingdom of Armenia is the most advanced. Well, that's a bit sad. That's a bit annoying. Oh, okay, we've got two people coming of age. Erechtheos the Mikos. Which ones get the cavalry general then? Because all these guys are getting normal generals. Okay, you are Megalopolite, one influence, oligarch, respects his father, Lily Livered. So we don't want you to be a general, even though you are understanding of tactics. So let's find a decent place for you to govern. I mean, Aegon is, is fine. You the other one that came of age. Uh, yeah, you are. And then Mikos of Corinth. So, Mikos, trusty, reverent, understanding of strategy, oligarch, Corinthian, and considerate. You're pretty good as a uh, as a uh, ruler as well. I think I think we send you up to places that we're trying to culture convert, like Argadaba. How culture converted are you? Yeah, we'll go up there, and then we'll send. Oh, you were in Corinth, right? The other one was in. Where was the other one? Athens, was he? Yeah. Could get you managing some of these big cities like Larissa. I think it's better to have you up in places where we're culture converting. Like, well, is Argadava, is that culture converting as well? Argadava and Samir Sarmizegudusuza. Those are the two that we want to convert, really. It's fine. Right, Sparta's built irrigation. Awesome. Just annoyed that Sparta's not a huge city yet. What will that allow us to get, though, in terms of stuff that we can't get? Oh, it's getting Spartan cavalry bodyguards, so we can get cavalry generals rather than all these infantry generals, which is, is good. I'd rather that. Right then, let's, uh, let's do that building. So Sparta, let's build... Uh, I mean, the Hippodrome, it doesn't add anything. It doesn't allow us to get better cavalry. So, it's a bit pointless. Let's go for the dockyard, then. Roads, let's go for... There's not much else we really want here. Let's just go for that. Pella, got the strategy yet. Awesome, awesome. That's really good. That allows us to train whatever we want now. Awesome. Pella, build the dockyard. By Lazora. We've got the Shrine to Ares. Could get the Shrine to Hera. Let's get the Forion. Sarmizegetuza. Rebuild that. And let's build... A large Temple of Hera, definitely. 
Dark Adava. Let's build some paved roads. And Tylus. Let's build some paved roads in Tylus as well. Get those roads everywhere. Oh, look, here come the Adrissians. Ooh, spicy. Let's, oh, let's split them. They're going to have to choose which army to go for. And if they attack with all that might, that army will probably die, honestly. But it will do enough damage that we can basically take these without too much worry from then on. Damn get I just go away. <laughs> just die. Please. Oh my god, look at the amount of armies over here. Right, you guys, whatever. Okay, you're retraining still. Let's uh recruit some cavalry while we can. You're there. You're going to buy Lazora. Okay. So, Cleonimus' army, where do we go with you? Ideally, back and fight the Getai again. This army needs to come back down to Pella for retraining. We can't even get to Pella. Just get to here then. That's fine. Cleonimos, you're going up there to fight the Getai. You're coming down. You guys are going in by Lazora. Uh, you guys are fine. You guys are going by Lazora as well. You guys are going by Lazora. <laughs> oh, it's so many people. Where are you going? It's the wrong place. You go by Lazora. You're all getting retrained. That's good. You're there. You're there. We'll pretty much have another army ready to go very soon. Need to get the guys out of Sparta. If we guys out of Sparta join up with these guys in Bailazora, they will be ready to fight. Oh, excellent. Another army then. So we have this army over in Suggestica that obviously needs a little bit of retraining, but it's okay in general. You could go after the Getai, actually. Hmm. You do have better troops. And you've got Lithoboloi, which might make them slightly scared. So let's do that. I'm just a slightly worried there's a bit of an army over there. The, what, the army in Suggestica can hold itself. If, if they want to try and break down our walls, they can do. We have Phalanx units. And Phalanx units in a straight-up street fight should win. Should just block them off with our phalanxes. Right then. Let's have a look at some of these settlements. Which ones are not Greek? So Nysus and Singuidum are. Arkadava's obviously not. Darkadava's not. Sanregizekatuza is. Oiskos is now. Excellent. Really good. That's going to help with Arkadava. So over here. Yeah. Once we get that general in there. It'll be fine. Oh, we've got some good units over here. Uh, good mercenary units. We need a mercenary man to lead the mercenary units once these guys have... So that's only a 20% still. You can see. Neighbouring regions is the main issue. Oiskos... Oiskos... Is Oiskos neighbouring? It looks like it is. So Oiskos should be helping that right now. If Arkadava gets... Gets turned. That's going to be a huge, huge benefit. Tylus is Greek now. Excellent. Philippopolis was anyway. Amphipolis is obviously Greek. How about Orestia? We're not converting here yet, are we? Oh, we are. We are, we are. That's fine then. Right. Is that everything? I believe so. Lots of armies moving around, guys. And I know we've got to do a lot of army management all the time. But, as I say, that's, that's basically what happens when you get to this point in the game. You got a lot of armor, especially in a game like this, where you know it's still difficult. It's still we're still losing battles. We're not steamrolling people just yet, and we definitely won't steamroll the uh, the Romans. Like that's not possible. I don't think there's a faction that could do that apart from maybe the horse archer factions, maybe Sarka or Parni or Parthia. God damn, we we've lost a lot of money there. Ah, uh, we really need to focus on our money as well as these culture conversions.
What are the Getai doing? Like, that's just silly. What are you doing down there? Okay, Spy going into Dark Adalva again. That's going to reduce our public order there. God damn. God damn fools! I tell you, fools! Yep, they're going to siege us down. Good. Please attack, though, within a couple of turns, my friend. That'll help us. I did kind of want those stone walls to be done. But that's fine. Wooden walls are not good, but they'll be they'll be okay. <laughs> they'll be okay. Right, rival merchant. I don't care. Uh, Sarka, Seleucids, Parthia, and Bactria. Master of Archers, Kellyas of Sparta. Whoa, okay. You're in Sparta. You're 22, and you're an absolute beast. You're good at everything. You're even a better general, though. I wish you were cavalry. I wish you were cavalry so much. So much. Why are you not cavalry? Right, well, this army... Why do we have Skiritai in this army? It's trash. We don't want the Skiritai or that or that. So, we will replace them with good new units. Okay. The, interestingly enough, the Adrissians did nothing. <laughs> they did nothing! What are they doing? Well, that was four units we got rid of. Let's get another cavalry as well because... Oh, I forgot to retrain these boys in there, didn't I? That's fine. Get a cavalry and then one more of these. Where are you going to go, though? Hmm. I think we're worried about the Adrissians. I think Rome. I think Rome. So many wars. So many different fronts. <laughs> we could actually... Could actually go for it now. Hmm. Most advanced faction again. That's good. Let's do our building. Aegeon. Let's get some more walls, bro. <laughs> it's not that important. Ambrakia. Okay, Ambrakia, we're doing training. So, let's get that experience to get that extra experience as well. Thessalonica. Let's go for the Odos. The Odon, or whatever. Odeon. Philippopolis is just upgraded. Awesome. Let's go for the aqueduct. Nisus. Okay. Nisus is converting pretty nicely now then. Let's get that. Arestia. Go for the sewers. Thomas. Let's have a look. Thomas can go for the public baths, I guess. It's fine. Sigwadunum. Sigridum is now Greek. Fantastic. Go for those large mines. Arkadava, let's go for that paved roads. Samirze Getuza is now unhappy, as usual. Oh, why are you so unhappy all the time, my friend? You need to come down to Pella. You, you're going by the Zora, aren't you? Make sure we retrain them this time. Jesus. Don't forget it this time. There we are. Let's just sit in pellet. You're just spare units. I think the Skiritai. Actually, what we'll do, we'll send these guys up north to defend Suggestica, I guess, when we leave Suggestica. Um, cool. Yep. And you guys, I mean, uh, you guys as well. I guess you can join them. You're going up to Rome. I believe you are. You were going to Argadava. Where's that other general then that we were sending up? 
You're going to me get it get to use that. Awesome. I think we're we're pretty pretty decent situation here. Send the crypt here forward. So that they can man the cities afterwards. Hmm. Well, I think we're in a decent spot. I think we're good. I think we're doing alright. You guys need to go to Bailazora for retraining. Oh, you got to actually fit. Awesome. Good, 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 good. You're going back with that army. That army's going to get reinforced with these guys. Then we'll probably have close to enough for another army. What should we be training at Pella? Get a Lithobolite again. I think we've got enough Cav. We need two more archers for a new army, so let's get those two. Two archers. Fine. Okay, you're... Oh, you were going up to... Asanka. Hmm. Could take these Adrissian places as well. And just really just end the Adrissians. I think that's the best thing that we can do. Get there. Build that. There we are. See a bit more now. Let's go for uh, Piero Brevadara. Awesome. Well, guys, I think that is going to be everything for today because I've got some stuff I need to go and do now. So it is a slightly shorter episode than normal, guys. So I'm sorry about that. Um, but hopefully I will see you soon. So please do like, subscribe, all that good stuff. And I'll see you again on the next video.